This is the mighty meatball. He's an almost three-year-old pug, and I see him on a daily basis for socialization. Today, he is here for his full grooming treatment. Meatball has the most vivacious personality that puts a smile on my face daily. We start with a massage to calm him down because he is very rambunctious. Once he has calmed down, I am bathing him today in our de-shedding shampoo. Meatball just recently lost his manhood, so prior to that, I used to refer to him as the meaty balls, but now he is a meatless ball. He is the most famous dog that I groom, and he is known around the world. And if you didn't notice, he is very much enjoying his bath. After that, I make sure to get in his wrinkles with my tearless formula, because those can get very dirty, and then I fully rinse him down. I also gave him a deep conditioning treatment in our mink oil conditioner by BioGroom. How could anyone not love that adorable smushed face? Once he is rinsed, I give him a nice towel dry, but Meatball would prefer to towel dry his own face, so I put a towel on the ground for him and he goes to town. Once he is ready for the blow dry, I ask Meatball if he would like to phone home. If you know, you know. And then I fully blow dry him with my high velocity dryer. It's very important to fully dry double coated dogs if you wanna be able to de-shed them properly it's also important because you do not want their coat to stay damp as that can cause hot spots. The high velocity dryer also does a great job at removing tons of dead coat. Once he is completely dry, I use my hypoallergenic wipes made by Tropiclean to clean out his wrinkles once more. They get very dirty as you can see. And then I brush him with the Ecri Groomer. The Ecri Groomer is my favorite de-shedding tool for almost all double-coated breeds. It does a great job of removing dead undercoat. Since Meatball gets groomed once a month, he does not lose as much hair as the average pug. While pugs do not necessarily need to be groomed, it definitely helps to lessen the amount of fur in your house. After we have finished de-shedding him, we move on to ear cleaning, and he thoroughly enjoys that process. And Meatball is not your typical pug, which means he does not throw a fit that sounds like aliens invading the world when you clip his nails. Although he doesn't like it, he knows better. I finish him off by spraying him down in my most favorite blueberry cologne. And he's all finished. Continue watching if you would like to know who is the star of our next week's show as well as our giveaway. I want to thank everybody for following me so quickly. I did not think I would have 100,000 subscribers this soon. And to celebrate that, I will be giving away a $300 cash prize to someone in the comments. So please comment, like, subscribe, and let me know what kind of dog you would like to see.